Hi everybody! So what is it that drives you? What is it that push you to the limit and beyond? You know, a lot of people say that their drive by motivation or some passion and most likely when they say it's motivation it's a lot of times when we have to watch some uh, YouTube video about motivation or reading some book about motivation or uh, see a movie about motivation and you get the idea and so on and so forth there's so many things with motivation but when we depend on motivation it will deteriorate it and will never uh, stay with us and stick with us for uh, a long period of time uh, and it could let's say drive us for a day to let's go beyond a bit a month but after that it will deteriorate it and you will stay without drive and you will have to keep that uh, motivation up to see every day uh, YouTube video every day to read a book every day to uh, hear some podcast about motivation itself and that doesn't think that stick with us so what is it that is will stick with us what is that thing that can keep us dry, drive and really go all in and break every barrier um, this thing is pain now wait a second let me explain you know uh, a lot of neuro neurological studies uh, show that pain is something that keep us drive and on really start with taking action and decision and how exactly does it all work uh, I will give you an idea uh, when I got injured in the army nine years ago uh, got a syndrome that called CRPS chronic pain re chronic regional pain syndrome and when I got injured I was before that I was very active going all day uh, for trips uh, going for workout every day I was really active and then from that place to come to a place where you lose your health you kind of lose yourself as well in that process and in that darkest time I take myself by the hand for a long time I was in depression I didn't have even the power to even start something and the minute I was in the biggest pain that I said that's it no fucking more no more I won't stay that shit anymore I don't want to stay I don't want to feel that way any longer and it's time to take action and do something about it or else I will stay that same old place I will cut my leg off and will stay at depression all my life and that's not the place I want to stay with and be in so in that place I take action I took a mentor I start to take actions I start to see what can I do in order to grow and not stay the same place and when I combine it with my why I kind of uh, made a structure if you will because when you take your pain and you take your deepest why combine it together you, like I said you have kind of a structure that keeps you motivated every single day and even if you have a bad moments and it will happen when you remind yourself why you do it and you remind yourself that pain that you don't want to go back anymore it will get you back on your feet in an instant without you even realize that you're doing it and because it will be in your subconscious mind all the time because as human beings we don't want to go back to a painful place to a painful moment and we kind of um, let ourselves by the hook and say I don't want to remember that I will uh, deny it will ever happen and that is the worst case to be because pain is also something good when we take it as a drive uh, and like I said when you take it as a drive and combine it with your meaning why you do what you do you have a strong 
a very powerful tool to use to break every fucking barrier and really go out there with a full full head we don't and you won't give a fuck about anything when you're at that place when you're at that moment so to find out your biggest pain to find out your why you should sit with yourself and think about what is it that you feel and i know it will sound ridiculous but what is it that you made you feel more shitty what is the field the place that you feel like I don't want to feel that li like it anymore when you think about it and remember what is the place that you don't want to go back this is your most strongest pain and when you combine it with your why when you think about why you do it why you do what you do and a great exercise by Dean Graziosi the seven whys when you ask yourself seven times why until you get you peel off every layer and you get to the bottom of it what is your biggest why then you combine it with your pen BAM you're on your way like that so uh, and uh, you're welcome to share with us what is the action that you're going to take today in order to find your uh, your structure if you will so what is it that action that you're going to do today just comment below what is the action that you're going to do today in order to get your structure just comment below get your accountability by just comment and uh, comment below and have an amazing and productive day and if you like this video give me a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe and don't forget to join our community the rise up community when you get more tips and tricks to monetize your business because who knows the next post can bring you the tool that you need to lift your game and to lift your business and also on the 21 there's going to be a summit a great summit with 15 uh, online experts that will help you to scale your online business and it's free and just sign up to reserve your seat and I will see you there and again have an amazing and productive day I really appreciate that you took the time to listen I will see you tomorrow